live in the one zero 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 two. The one zero zero two zeros in the news. Not the major papers, but the independent views. Things ain't looking sweet, no lemon scented cues. The story's more sour, full of bitter bits and chews. Of a tale that's hard to follow, like the script's a bit confused. Billionaire welfare queens on Park Avenue. Billionaire welfare queens on Park Avenue. The government spends 20 billion every year. Paying folks who net worth is already in the air. Sky high ranking, big banking, private jets full tanking. We can take to the clean and dirty work with no thank you. Common people catching spankings, rich folks is red handed. The more they make, the bigger the tax breaks for these bandits. And they don't talk about it never. I can understand it because it doesn't add up in there. Blame the poor propaganda. Billionaire welfare queens on Park Avenue. The more I read about it, the more I'm catching an attitude. Got me daydreaming about stalking a hood's a bag of food. Then I remember that the courtrooms ain't got no latitude. Narrow views are bound, boundaries on us like cattle rules. Funny they get farm subsidies and try to chatter you. Same people own the prisons. Listen, this is factual. They act like profits and form of poverty is practical. Billionaire welfare queens on Park Avenue. Billionaire welfare queens don't pay no taxes for. Yeah, when I send a fast shout out to Yasha Levine and the New York Press who wrote this little story about the making of Manhattan's elite welfare farms. Another big shout out to Kim Cook from the Environmental Working Group. They put a bunch of people on blast, you know what I'm saying? Mad people on blast. Read the story, I'm not gonna name no names. Mark Rockefeller. Ha, ha, ha.